I'm John Proxy, welcome to the Proximity. This is Milk Made of the Milky Way, the next step in my Itch Eye Odyssey. Uh, uh, it's a series where I play a bunch of games from Itch.io because they're all in a bundle. There's like a thousand of them. Of them. A thousand of them. Try and say it properly. Try and enunciate the words, John. Anyway, um, yeah, there's a lot of them. I've d this is like episode 51, I think. Uh, 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 anyway. Uh, <laughs> it's quite daunting. Uh, it's taken me like a year to do that. Uh, it's been quite a year. Anyway, um, let's press a new game, shall we? Girl and her uh, bovine west of Norway, 1959. This is a story from the Calf Ledge, a small farm perched. Nice song. Uh, this music uh, on a mountain edge. What's an edge? made of the Milky Way. A game by Mattis Folkstad. Another restless night. Luckily the storm had passed. The fields were wet, but the sun was rising fast. Is this supposed to be poem? I had not been speaking in rhyme. Eight hours spent in bed, I heard impatient mooing from the shed. Milking and the dairy were my priorities. Today, Ireland was coming to pick up the cheese. My milk bucket and tools were gone, so strange. Had a thief wandered through this mountain range. Cheese, mother's recipe. Pour fresh milk in a separator, separate the milk. Skim the skim milk, keep the cream for later, the milk won't curdle by default. Bring it to boil and add vinegar and salt, don't let it clot, stir, stir, stir the pot. Okay, that's all what poem as well. Alright, so, um, I'm gonna say right now, uh, this page isn't so bad. Uh, no, 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 right, so, uh, I'm, I'm learning how to make a game, I'm gonna mention this like every other episode. Because it's pertinent, alright, uh, because I'm looking at a bunch of games. Now this game looks really good. But I've now been taught, the particular person I'm learning of, the internet personality, but one of his pet peeves is what he calls Mixels, uh, which I think one of his um, audience names, but where, like, different things on the screen have different pixel sizes, like, for instance, this cursor uh, has a completely different mix uh, pixel size than... Like, so this book and that matches, right? But the writing clearly doesn't, and this cursor clearly doesn't. Uh, butter. The churner, and there's a lot of, like, there's a lot of that, and it's gonna bug me now, because I've been, uh, I've been taught to look out for it. But actually, the game actually looks fine. If you, if you're this good at drawing, you can probably get away with it. But it does stand out. The churner must be full of cream, beat it hard, go full steam, Turn the butter till it's thick, and it should become hard and stick. Remember to keep it cool, or else it will melt to a pool. Today I repaired the separator and added a feature to the accelerator. When I separate the milk and cream, it will automatically run down in a stream. Ready for butter making, leaves time for bread making. Remember to grease the door, it's been stuck before. Hinges need oil or grease, and they sound like flock of geese. Sometimes I make my point too fast, but then I have to say more, or people are left aghast. At school today, a boy bought a bike. He laughed and said, you'll fall, I swear. Riding it was harder than it looked like, but it felt so good to feel the wind in my hair. This 
spinning wheels for making yarn, but we no longer kept sheep in our barn. Now this matches. Apart from the X doesn't notice the thing now. Anyway, uh The churn was used to beat cream into spread. It made thick greasy butter perfect for bread. Reading books was my greatest passion. Erland would give me a weekly ration. So this changes size because the way the game zooms in and out. But she's affected by the light as well. My parents' portrait! They're wide open stare. They seem to be following me everywhere. That was when I slept lately, not so well. Soon sounds woke me up and an like an alarm bell. I took the spoon, I would need it soon. We made cheese in kettles like these. I took some firewood, but it was wet. Everything had soaked in the rain, I bet. Um, I suppose I'll go in this door over here. I sincerely doubt there's anything to fear. Lyke was patient and astoundingly clever. I raised her as a calf. She'd known me forever. Looking, I saw from their shudders, they tiptoed impatiently with bulging udders. Is that a quest? I said, uh, out aloud. Uh, I, uh, the people who made this would certainly be proud. Even when I stretched my hand, elbow and knee, I couldn't reach the fruit of the tree. Ah, I can run. I exclaimed, exclaimed with a lark. Uh, thankfully I learned that before it was dark. Uh, Towns was a free hour hike away. The cows needed herding. I needed to stay. stuck in the wood. How had the bucket ended up here? Had the wind made it disappear? I suppose it's difficult to have rhymes in that meter. when you have to maintain this ludicrous theatre. I'm going to move my face to the other side. Uh, hopefully my head will enjoy the ride. Right, I'm back and I'm moved. Uh, and so has this girl. Uh, I figured I'd give this area a whirl. The lake was crystal clear and frigid. Swimming here would leave you frigid. I thought was that was a mountain top. Uh, that it would take forever to get there. Uh, thankfully, we came to a stop. Uh, can now see the wind in our hair. Picked up some rocks, squarish like flat blocks. 
flowers I'd left here were dry as a bone after being left out in the wind all alone. With a sudden gust, the dry flowers turned to dust. The thought of falling, the fear of heights. I'll keep looking around to see what can be found. These episodes are only 30 minutes long. Find the long with long. No! <laughs> I broke the gimmick. This game that I was trying to mimic. I think she said some words just then. But I was distracted by my brain. Sip of cola uh, that I plucked from a uh, tombola. You can't see it, it's off the side. Uh, it's uh, certainly my joy and pride. It's a different world up here, Mother's had said, past these rocks. The cows were fed. Such beauty, but so remote, I swallowed the lump in my throat. At night, the cows slept indoors, lay as pillows on the floors. I met the cows like always we're bringing them up to graze. Milk, a bucket to carry milk and other dairy. White girls, time to squeeze out some milk for the butter and cheese. After milking, as always, I led the cows up to graze. Till evening the cows could do as they please. What? That didn't have a rhyme. And that would be... No, don't rhyme rhyme with crime, John. It's the worst one. Oh crap, I actually missed what that said. Uh, I got so distracted by the lack of rhyming. Uh, uh, and then completely messed up my timing. The crow cows grazed lazily on the mountain grass. For a cow, this was definitely first class. For a second, I thought there was an ominous figure, but it was actually clouds. Uh, uh, don't you dare snigger. I was trying to figure out the uh, a different word, but my brain just refused to... Something... <laughs> It looks like a colossus popping out side. Uh, it's the top of his head. Uh, you can't see his eyes. Can the cows not graze here where there's plenty of grass? She has to walk them through over this pass. That seems quite ludicrous, uh, if I were to say, but don't let game logic get in your way. This is a game that has aliens in, there's no reason for 
quibbles to throw it in bin. Is this gotten old yet? I imagine it has. I bet. I'm rather curious as to when they will turn up. The aliens, I mean. Uh, I, that's been set up by the title of the game and the visual with it. Uh, if I don't see said aliens, then I will uh, regret it? That's terrible, child. I don't think anyone's going to stick around after like a hundred bad vibes. Uh, Unless I had like a celebrity like Liam Vine? No, that's still the word rhymes. Uh, bucket was full. A heavy weight. It was ready to separate. Is my... Am I... Trying to make cheese? I... I, I would rather do as I please. Fuck my cheeks burning, that was only used for churning. I had used the light at another location, the spinning was mostly for decoration. Where does the separation happen? Your hand ablaze to force the cream and milk to part ways. My modification was clever. Without any clutter, my cream would trickle down and to be turned into butter. Had I been visited by the vandal, the separator was missing its handle. What should I do? I drew a blank. I could make butter without the crank. The separator was only for milk and things of silk. You just said it needed a handle! Uh, you ruddy spandle. I know that's not a handle, it's a piece of wood. But I thought that in a pinch that that thing should work in a pinch. I said that already. I wish I didn't have to buy this already. I just did the same word twice. I think it's Lily, uh, you, you voicing yourself to do rhymes is actively uh, making this worse than it needs to be. Uh, it doesn't take a genius to see. Up here, I had no one to impress, so I wore my pants instead of my dress. This says where I might find a handle. I've already had to say words. You sp spandle. The trick is to say handle before the end. Then you don't have to sentence to bend.
fruit had a certain appeal. Its fresh smell and yellow peel. Growing fruit had been mother's quest. We usually didn't go out here in the west. Time was three hours hike away. The cows needed herding and needed to stay. I reckon the cows are dying, to be honest. Uh, I wish I didn't have to rhyme the word honest. I lost it for a second because I clicked off screen. Uh, <laughs> if I had lost all my footage, then I would s scream. Different world up here, Mother had said. Um, I wish I could turn my cows into bread. Can I turn on a full screen window so I don't have a headache if it were to break? Do you have a handle? I asked to the cows. I would ask all the elks and I would ask all the sows. I have a pole to use as a tether, a boat had sunk in the stormy weather. I'm not going to see aliens, am I? I wish I could see them come from the sky. It would keep me up at night. Okay, we're going to see this. I had to read it again. Put me in this. Put me in this. Said with a scowl. Uh, it's, I can't do that comment. These uh, a mysterious owl. Father and me had built this for mother a year later, a memorial for another. getting abused. That is to say, I wanted something slightly more exciting. Uh, you know, maybe we could have caused some cow in fighting. Had the rock fallen from the mountainside, it was two meters tall and one meter wide. It looked like a huge salt stone, its shape mysterious and unknown. had fallen off the rock, I picked up a decent sized block. I came to a halt, it looked and tasted like salt. Ah, oh, never mind, I'm still milk making milk. Hopefully, uh, I can present it to the spacemen and their ilk. We've got four minutes to go. Uh, I won't have time to complete this. Uh, before I have to let you go. Huh. 
handle I must find. If you would be so kind. for a crank I thought that I could break the spinner uh, clearly that was a bad idea though I thought I was on to a winner breadcrumb so I could eventually see where the handle might be. It's a crank charm. I've been saying it wrong. Now, I appreciate that we've barely begun, but I'm afraid that we are done. I'm going to jump to the future uh, so we can <laughs> do our impressions. That didn't rhyme. It's difficult to rhyme all the, the words I've chosen. Oh god, that's just, I'm, I, I, let's not do my impressions in rhyme. I probably, had I not been rhyming, would I have done better in this game? Is it myself that I have to blame? Maybe. <laughs> or was I just making my own fun? Did I improve it? We'll find out later. I'm here to talk about Milkmaid of the Milky Way. Uh, certainly not going to depict contemporary ennui and unease by subverting the iconography of Midwestern Americana. Certainly not. Oh my word, who would do such a thing? Right, <laughs> what did I think of Milkmaid of the Milky Way? Well, we're going to need, this one's going to be quite easy, isn't it? Uh, we're going to need some skies and some fields, right? There we go. You know what? I'll put some mountains up first. Uh... No, undo, undo, undo. Some mountains. Zarka wants to be further away, right? We can do that, we can do that. Right, uh, what did I actually think about it? Well, I thought the art was quite nice. Uh, you know, I had some issues with mixels and stuff, but like, that's just net. Uh, just, uh, Petty nitpicking. It didn't seem very detailed. I'm sort of used to. Well, I guess more detailed. Uh, is <laughs> uh, anyway. Uh, but that's that's fine. That's just style, right? Uh, I guess the main issue is I never really got to the game right. I was spent all my half an hour on the deliberate setup quest and never got to see any aliens. Even if there are aliens, don't know if there are aliens in the game. You know what I mean? Uh, and that's a bit of an issue because it means. How can I really judge the game? Oh look, do we have a lake? Do we have a lake? Was there any lakes? We could keep this as a lake, couldn't we? Okay, there's a little lake as well. Um, 
it's kind of a good picture. Yeah, I thought I I got myself a second white there. Uh, but yes, so maybe like I can't really judge the storyline. I thought uh, the rhyming the rhyming wasn't amazing. You 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 keep have to, having to rhyme the same words. Now, obviously, I was rhyming along as well, which probably made, it compounded the issue. But I think, gimmickly speaking, having a constant rhyme throughout is gonna get old unless you, it's a really good poem, right? Uh, and this isn't a really good poem because you choose the pace, uh, which means it's it's gonna have lots of repeating. It was fine, like uh, if a little, you know, unneeded. Uh, but like, because it's the A A B E B C C rhyme. There were occasional different rhymes, but mostly A A B B type of rhymes. Um, let's. Uh, that that that. There wasn't amazing, like the dialogue and stuff. Uh, but it was different. Like, you don't have to deal with trying to be witty, right? Because that's much. Somebody who's trying to be witty but isn't witty. Is, that's just the worst thing. Uh, so it didn't have that issue. Okay, what's it called? Milkmaid. Milkmaid. Of the Milky Way. Of course, these are my impressions, but I'll put that, I guess, down the bottom. Uh, I need to actually draw the milkmaid. Uh, she has. Uh, she, she can. He's up a mountain. Okay, cool. Green hair. Uh, right, cool. Uh, that's me looking for a bucket. So I think maybe, maybe we'll draw some cows. Uh, I've changed my mind. Change my mind again. We're gonna have black and white cows. I don't know what the cows actually look like. I, I imagine they have tails as well. So there's a tail. Uh, um, I think as an introductory uh, quest, it wasn't very good. Uh, because I got stuck and. Like, it's fine again getting stuck on a game, but not right at the very start, right? Then we're gonna add like black spots to it. Give it an eye. And have this spots like that, there you go. I think I did quite well to pick them and I don't like that last bit. To pick from those cows to be honest. I think I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, maybe we'll, we'll, we'll make the grass a little bit more exciting. Around this. There go. See the bits of grass. Beautiful. Um, uh, yes. I think the thing is. The whole pixel shirt searching thing is the worst part of point and click games. Uh, and we sort of grew past them with the 3D ones where they look at important items. And of course we've lost that again with any resurgence. But also just little hint systems uh, go a long way. Just like where would it go? And just go maybe it's on this screen. I don't know something to just help me out get to the more interesting part of your game. Other than that I thought it was fine. Um, it's apparently award winning uh, I guess it's because it's half drawn and half pixel and it's about a milkmaid in space or something that makes it more interesting than other ones I, I have to assume I don't know it seemed fine but like nothing to write at home about like if you force me to play it more at gunpoint I'd I'd be reasonably happy to do so. It would have been certainly been on a maybe if I was keeping maybes, but I'm not keeping maybes anymore. Uh, because 
you know, I've got an entire lifetime. Uh, <laughs> if I don't want to go back, then why force myself? Uh, anyway, that's what I think about that game. Oh, I forgot to put the word impressions. Ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> All clouds. It's a really easy thing I could have done with white. F! Oh, it's... Oh, the only thing I was supposed to do is not depict contemporary ennui and unease by subverting iconography, iconography of Midwestern Americana. Oh, and no, I did exactly that! Ah, oh, never mind. <laughs> Let's go back. Right, that was Milkmaid of the Milky Way. It's not, it was, it won awards. Um, and uh, I never got to see the spaceship. Oh, never mind. Uh, we're going to next play Crashed Lander. Uh, which apparently uses VR or monitor. I, I might even try and use... Right, let me do this again now. I've got my lights on. Uh, yes, that was Milkmaid of the Milky Way. It uh, apparently won an award um, for being a rhyming point. I, I completely missed that it was rhyming as well. I mean, not in the game, obviously. I obnoxiously tried to rhyme my way through this video. But our next game is going to be Crashed Lander. If, and I suspect that is... It's just a game about landing, isn't it? And then your fosters, you know, that very basic game. But in VR, which I will, yeah, I'll give VR a go. I might not do it for the entire video because I can't be able to change my entire setup. But yeah, we'll check it out. I mean, I'm going to check it out regardless. Let's have a closer look, shall we? Right, well, this always already looks a lot more interesting than I thought it was going to be just by these screenshots. Um, I still think it's probably just going to be a... a, a Spaceship Lander, but this is a gravity based arcade game based like classics like Lunar Lander, which is what I was thinking. Uh, and Space Taxi, your pilot craft from pad to pad trying to beat your best time and flirt with that fine line between speed and control. Uh, you, if you're brave enough to try hard mode, you'll be flopping around like Quoppy, uh, low gravity turtle. Uh, with a little practice, you'll be zipping, doing barrel rolls. So, I guess recently, um, Outer Wilds uh, was kind of uses that mechanic, doesn't it? So, yeah, somebody was ahead of the curve. Um, I assuming this was made quite some time ago uh, and isn't brand new. Let's give this a go. Well, I mean, for me, I'm giving it a go right now. Uh, for you, I'm letting you go. Uh, normally, I jump back into the game. The game really doesn't like me alt tabbing like this, so I'm gonna let you go here instead. Uh, you should have made it slightly more friendly to alt tab. I'm sorry, uh, Milkmaid. Th I, thank you for watching this video. I've been having uh, Milkmaid. Uh, uh, it's, it was an HI Odyssey, isn't it? Uh, but it was about. Hang on. What I can do is. Yeah. Okay. So we're now on the milk. Milkmaid of the Milky Way. It looked kind of interesting, didn't it? I had all these things that I never got to see. Um, but this, I guess. Mostly, I guess, this hand-painted stuff is just going to be neat. Uh, unfortunately, the game was slightly incomplete. Uh, yes, anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.